Hello everybody, greetings from New York City. My name is Rashid Ulberi. And my name is Rafat Bari. We are here today to promote Shubhan Isaac's recent interview with MIT scientist. Um, Shubhan Isaac has made a history uh, yesterday. Uh, this was the first time a six-year-old sat with MIT scientists for over five hours. Uh, solving some cutting-edge physics and math problem, giving solution to black hole uh, and uh, black hole problem, and other and 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 introducing uh, the math he created for black hole. Uh, so uh, uh, next few minutes we're going to talk about it and we're going to promote his interview because we are about to release uh, this interview for. Uh, for people around the world, because we believe that if people around the world, especially student, school, college, university student watch this interview, they will fall in love with math and science. Uh, this is why we are trying to uh, promote this interview. Shobhan is a recent interview with MIT scientist. So uh, those uh, those those of uh, the people who don't know about Shobhan Isaac, you can. Uh, you can tell them about um, a little bit about Shubhan Isaac. So uh, Isaac is a six-year-old genius who was uh, who was born in April 9, 2012. Yeah. He got recognition from President Obama only at a three-year-old. Mm -hmm. That was the first time any uh, any president of the United States ever um, gave a recognition uh, to mm -hmm. a three-year-old three-year-old mm -hmm. uh, three boy. And then, uh, and then he uh, uh, that followed by many recognition coming from all around the world, including Harvard University. Uh, even Harvard University, of course, even Harvard University. How recently Harvard University president gave him recognition? So recently, only yesterday, Shubhan Isaac uh, sat down with MIT scientist. MIT scientist took his interview, five hour long interview. It's, uh, it's, it's hard to believe that a six-year-old sat with MIT scientist for five hours solving some of the most difficult problem of our time. This is why you decided to uh, promote this interview. interview. Mm -hmm. So the MIT scientist first asked him Ask him to explain him what is light. Right, and uh, Isaac uh, responded by saying that light could either behave like a particle or behave like a wave. Uh, he uh, started with uh, telling MIT uh, scientists that uh, many people contributed. Uh, to many people, help us understand the behavior of light, including um, Sir Isaac Newton. Albert Einstein, uh, Max Planck, and Niels Bohr. Now, what he sent is ask Schumann Isaac to explain how Newton helped us understand the behavior of light. Right, and then he also asked. Ah, uh, you wanna, you wanna, you you wanna tell them his his response? Oh uh, yeah. yeah. So uh, Newton said that. Um, Light behaved much like a wave. So no, Newton said light behaved much like a particle. Newton, uh, Newton took a white light, uh, and Newton, uh, Newton, show demonstrate that when white light, white light passed through prism, it's a split into rosy beep. What is rosy beep? Red, orange, yellow, green. Uh, blue, indigo, and violet. Yes, uh, is separate because the different light bands.